what's up guys how's it going so I actually had some cavities filled today um, the numbness is like just now wearing off I posted on Instagram about it if you are following me already on Instagram you should I try to take the things that happen or are relevant in my life and spin them in a positive empowering context because I always believe that there's something to learn from everything. Go ahead and do that if you have not already. Otherwise, I'm just kind of hanging out at home today. Um, I'm expecting a delivery of more medications for this cycle, and so I have to be here to sign for that. Also, I've been finding recently that my appetite's a little off, and I know, like, I'm, I remember feeling last time I didn't feel super great with my diet because I'm not supposed to eat a lot of fruits and vegetables and I'm a vegan or like mostly vegan so um, that kind of threw me last time and I ate a lot of bread and I didn't feel super hot so I'm still dealing with the same limitations um, but I think I've also just been really busy and like running around so I kind of have been skipping meals and eating like snacks throughout the day and then I find my energy is kind of like depleted and I'm a little bit like airheady and like I don't know like, I can't think of the word right now. Um, lightheaded? A little bit, but I'm just kind of like less there. I'm drinking some um, gingery kombucha right now to see if that will kind of help settle my stomach and ease me into um, some food that I'm about to make. I've also been buying all my favorite um, vegan treats that still fit with this diet. So I got like ice cream and mac and cheese and all that jazz. So I'm gonna, oh, and fake chicken nuggets. I freaking love fake chicken nuggets. I don't know what it is. But I can't eat ketchup right now, so I was eating them with ranch last night, and it was, it was okay. It was all right, it was just all right. Yeah, I'm gonna stop talking, start cooking, and start editing. So real quick, I just want to mention that I don't usually eat this way, nor do I recommend that anyone necessarily eats this way. Um, for lunch slash sort of my first meal of the day, I'm having chocolate almond milk, um, fake chicken nuggets, rice peel off, and I might finish off with some ice cream. So <laughs> these are like my treats, and usually what I would do for um, like the chicken nuggets or the rice is eat them with a lot of greens or a lot of vegetables to kind of dilute the salt and um, mix in a lot of good things in there with something that's sort of more of a treat. Um, this, the chocolate almond milk, I just kind of bought as an homage to my childhood. Um, it just reminds me of being young and when the only flavor of non-dairy milk that I could stomach was chocolate. I'm gonna go ahead and get started editing. Yes. Well, the expert is. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, have a good day. You too. Woohoo. Oh, let's see what we got. Lied. This is one of the medications that will trigger ovulation once we know the eggs are big enough and we know when the procedure is going to be and when they need to get moving. So there's a little vial of it in here and some syringes. <laughs> this is not very high tech. 
these are my medications right next to the Guinness but hey they're cold 